Hello everybody, it is Black Blooded Kitten here, and I decided to start doing Warrior Cats rants. Um, I did one rant video on my old account, which is Wolfan60 or Eclipse Meow, and that was on Ashfur. And you guys can go check that out, I'll put a link in the description. And yeah, it's basically me ranting about Ashfur being in Star Clan and Ashfur himself. And if you guys want me to rant about a certain character or book or anything that has to do with Warrior Cats, even like the fan base and so on and so forth, just comment on the most recent rant so I can keep up with it. And yeah, so today we are going to be talking about Thristleclaw. And my opinions on him, honestly, I really liked Thristleclaw. But I also disliked him. I mean, he was bloodthirsty. We all can agree on that. He was a battle-hungry, bloodthirsty cat. But he wasn't evil. Not like Tiger Star. Not like Broken Tail or Broken Star. Um, not like those cats. He he just was battle-hungry. You could say like um, what was his name? Bloodclaw, the deputy of Wind Clan. He he was battle-hungry like that. Um, but he did really, really care for the cats he cared about. Like, um, Snowfur. Those two were adorable. You guys have to agree with me on that. I really like that pairing, honestly. Um, he was protective. He was sweet. I mean, yes, he was a jerk to any cat he didn't like. And he was trying to teach White Kit battle moves and all that, and... Just make every warrior battle hungry. That was his main problem. And if you guys don't know, he was at first in Star Clan, but when Blue Star died, she drove him out. Blue Star, look at me for a second. What are you doing? I try to like you, but then you just do stuff. That is uncalled for. Him. <clears throat> anyway, that's a rant for another time. Um. I liked him, but I didn't like how battle-hungry he was, basically. There's not much to say about him. Um, I mean, he did get worse as he went to the Dark Forest, but he was still just a battle-hungry cat. If he was in Star Clan, he'd be like, Oh yeah, let's beat those Dark Forest cats, because this is still a battle! He'd still be battling, no matter what side he was on, and excuse me, that was my Skype, not yours. <laughs> no matter what side he's on, he's still going to bat be wanting to battle someone. But, um, yeah. I liked him personally. I wish he was in Star Clan with Snowfur. That's what really kind of gets me angry about Blue Star, is that she had no right to drive him out. And I kind of wish they dwelled on that more. And we could see how Snowfur reacted to that and how things kind of collided into that. But, um, other than that, I thought he was a cool cat. Um, if he was less battle hungry, he would have been an amazing, amazing warrior that all kind of cats could have looked up to. But he was still a loyal cat, the Thunder Clan. You have to admit that. <laughs> he, he was loyal. He didn't pull a tiger star and did all that. I mean, yes, he got worse as he went to the dark forest, but as he was alive, he was a good cat. And I believe if Blue Star didn't drive him out of Star Clan, he would have been for the good. I mean, yes, he still would have been battle hungry, but he would have been with um, Snowfur. He would have been content with that. But anyway, guys, that's my rant. If you want to recommend me a warrior or a book or a scene or anything of the sorts, please comment on the most recent video of a rant. And I will try to get to all of them if I find something interesting I can talk to it about. So I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you next time.